Not very quick off the blocks. Lily King, quickest, along with Bethany Gallant, who also could be a huge factor. He was the silver medalist last summer at the World Championship. So you've got the back-to-back -back silver medalist in both World Championships and the world record holder in the 100 breaststroke in this race. Some really good swimmers here. So Lily King in the white cap is third from the top. That's the lane to watch. You think about the progress in this distance as she touches first at 50, Rowdy. In the Rio games, Lily King made the team in this, but she's, she didn't even make the finals. Yeah. In a year's time, she goes to Budapest last year and finishes fourth. Yeah, that's, that's the progress I expected out of Lily King. I'm not sure she's going to have that quite yet this summer, but it's going to happen. There's going to become, there's going to come a time where she's going to have one of those magical 200 breaststrokes. And again, it might not happen this summer, but every time she swims it, especially internationally, and she can swim it regardless whether she makes it here. Remember, you make one event here at these national championships, you can swim anything you want to at the Pan Pacific Championships in Tokyo. A lot of people have been asking, well, what, what is the Pan Pax? Well, it's a major international competition. Australia, Japan, two of the best swimming countries in the world will be there. It just won't include the Europeans. It's sort of a split summer. The Europeans have the European Championships. The Americans will go to Tokyo and race the Western world from Japan, China, Australia, and such. Boy, Micah Summer. Wow, she's, this, huh, this 50 time. has been terrific. And Micah Summer all is pulled out, and Lily King has faded. Bethany Gallant now charging up in the second, but you see the gap. And this is so great to see for Micah Summerall. A lot of people said she was gone. No way she would be able to come back after the disappointing factor that she did not make the team a couple years ago in 2016. But what a comeback, 28 years old. And here she is. She's going to punch a ticket now to Tokyo. Wow, what a swim. The push going to be for second. Bethany Gallup really driving hard. In fact, she's narrowing the gap on Summerall pretty significantly. But Micah Summerall comes in with Bethany Gallup second and Annie Laser third. And Micah Summerall's time, 2.22.06, is fourth fastest in the world this year. What a swim for Micah Summerall.